for them when you have an upset stomach. Today, we're just going to experiment with them. We're talking antacids. Dan Clements is here from the Imagination Station. Dan, we're going to be working with acids, uh, and you're going to show us visually how this kind of works, right? Well, I brought with me uh, an over-the-counter product for acid reflux called Gaviscon. Um, it's not exactly an antacid, okay. but I'm going to show you what it does. I brought some of the ingredients, and we're going to break them down one by one and just see exactly how this works. Fair there's enough. some pretty cool chemistry that's going on. Okay. Um, so right here, I've got uh, some stomach acid, some like simulated stomach acid, and I've got some calcium carbonate right here, which is one of the key ingredients. Okay. okay. So why don't you take a spoonful of this calcium carbonate and put it into our our acid right there and we'll see kind of the reaction that happens see what happens go ahead dump the whole spoonful in there okay so you can see some bubbling right there's actually two things happening we're releasing carbon dioxide gas okay all right and we're dissolving some of that calcium the calcium ions are being released as a solution into our acid here so go ahead and put another one in see all right, the reaction in See a reaction happening. If one there. was good, will two be better? All right, it's very similar to yeah. the reaction between an acid and a base that you might see in a baking soda and vinegar yep. type experiment. The same thing is happening. All right, we have uh, carbon dioxide being released here. All right, so that's one of the ingredients. So remember that carbon dioxide gas. I could do that. Calcium ions being released. Okay. Okay. Now I brought another ingredient. You can go ahead and put that down, Chris. I brought another ingredient. This is called sodium alginate. All right, and it's a common uh, food additive. It is a polymer. Which okay. Is pretty cool. And it comes from actually seaweeds. Which a is little gummy, a little thick, it okay. looks like. Yeah, and we're going to go ahead and test this. I've got some water here. We're going to see how the sodium alginate reacts with some water. So okay. go ahead and put a big squirt in there. There you go. Very good. All right, now, I brought some forks here. Uh, go ahead and grab a fork and test. See if anything happened with our water and our sodium alginate. Anything interesting? Uh, nope. Not really. If okay. it was a salad, I'd but be disappointed. We don't have just water in our stomachs, right? There's all kinds of stuff going on right. in there. Okay, so I brought some a calcium solution here. So just like the calcium we had in here. Okay, so go ahead and put a big squirt of your so sodium alginate in there, just like before, just swirling around there. Very good. All right, now, go ahead and grab your fork one more time and we'll see what happens. See if we did anything different there. Yeah. All right, so a little bit different, right? You got kind of like a slimy, wormy, like sludge there that we can kind of move around. Maybe we can grab some more. All right. So what happened was the calcium, all right, cross-linked with the sodium alginate to create this really cool solid polymer wormy stuff. And this, this same thing happens inside your stomach when you take Gaviscon. Ah. Same thing okay. happens. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is all of our experiments here are going to be combined together, all right, so with our carbon dioxide gas and our calcium and our sodium alginate, all right, they're all in our Gaviscon, okay, and I have some Gaviscon right here for you, all right, this is our simulated stomach and esophagus, Good. so acid reflux is when acid comes up into your the esophagus. Try to get it back down. All right, we want to keep it in your stomach, right, right? Okay. so this is our stomach and our esophagus here, and what we're going to do all right, as I'm going to hold this right down the center for you, and I'm going to have you go ahead and pour all of our Gaviscon straight down into our stomach. And you can see, if you look, you can see that we've created, we've cross-linked with our sodium alginate, and you can see the really cool worm-type polymers that we've created inside your stomach. And the same exact thing happens when you take Gaviscon. Now, there's some other reactions happening. If you look closely, right here, you can see kind of bubbles forming. Okay. That is our carbon dioxide gas. So our sodium alginate is trapping that carbon dioxide gas, and eventually you'll be able to see them start lifting up. All right, and they're going to start to form ah. a, a raft or a plug on the top of your stomach to keep that acid from coming up into your esophagus. All right, so if you eat too quickly, this is going to help well, alleviate some of that acid reflux. If you look at it right here, here it goes, forming a raft and plugging up that esophagus. Very cool science that's happening there. We can zoom out just a smidge. I think we'll be able to see that too, see that as well as right uh, there. just below is where we've got the uh, giant portion of that that is sort of plugged the top of the stomach, correct? Yep, it's blocks Ooh. off the top of the stomach, keeps that acid from coming up. Maybe if you eat too much food on Labor Day, here, you might be able to you, The lesson some. learned here is I'm going to avoid the chicken wings during football season <laughs> because I don't think I want that going on. Let's avoid it all together. But you have the science to break it down. That's very cool. What's going on with you guys at the Imagination Station? You're well, going to be open right through the weekend. Yep, we're open all weekend long. Even on Labor Day, we'll be open Okay. Uh, on Labor Day. So it's your last chance to come check us out before we 
close for uh, our fall cleaning. You do your fall cleaning, year. which will start September 8th, so you have through Labor Day to check it out. Yep. All right, Dan, appreciate that one. Stay with us. W211, your day is back in just a moment.